experience. We can, uh, there's a lot to learn from, but um, we'll learn from it, and we'll we'll come back this week, get back to um, what we preach every week, tackling, getting to the football, you know, just getting back to the basics of things, um, kind of resetting after last week, and just moving on, uh, moving on to this week. You share what have you seen from your teammates' ability to bounce back starting Sunday? Um, yeah, no, that's the, the, I think the guys are, I mean, we're, they're going to bounce back fine. Everyone is, um, the mindset of the team is, you know, it wasn't a lot of sad faces. It was, you know, we, we took one, we take that one on the chin, but, uh, we're going to move on to this week, um, continue to get better just like we've been doing all season and go out there and, uh, play, play as, um, play the best football we can. You've seen some good teams, but. Where's Ohio State stack up in terms of how they run the ball and just the weapons they have on offense? Yeah, no, I mean they're a really good team. Obviously, um, one of the one of the one of the one of the top guy, uh, teams in the country, and um, we're excited for it. It's going to be a great challenge for us. Um, um, just with the weapons they have on offense and stuff, we we can't wait. We're super excited to get out there and uh, play against those guys. What do you see from defensive teammates' confidence? In a game when things are going well, when things aren't going well, like how do you, how do you, where do you feel is that? Uh, yeah, no, obviously when things are going well, confidence is super high. Uh, I think um, some of the other guys on the team do a good job of keeping people's confidence uh, confidence high when things aren't going well. Uh, and um, we're just going to continue to um, build that confidence and um, um, sustain that through the rest of the year. What was a lesson learned? From the defense, talk about taking away lessons from last week. Uh, yeah, no, I mean it's just we we just we didn't go out there and play play how we wanted to. You know, we we had a great week of preparation. Things just didn't fall how they we wanted to. You know, they they were making plays and and we weren't. That's what it came down to. So just like I said, getting back to the basics, um, tackling and everything else um, this week, and just focusing on this week, um, learning from that one, but focusing on this week. A little different week this week with fall break. You guys spend more time around each other. Is that beneficial? Schedule a bit any, any different, other than you know, obviously not having class to go to. Uh, mm-hmm. yeah, no, it definitely helps. Um, to have fall break right now, we um, we get to spend more time as a group. Um, watching watching film is just a big group rather than you know a few guys watching it here because other guys are at class. So it's definitely beneficial just to have everyone in there um, watching film together. So yeah, it definitely helps. Anything else from Nash? How are you feeling after Saturday? Looked like you got a little bit. Uh, I'm feeling good. You know, I'm I'm ready to roll this week. I'm excited. Like I said, excited for the challenge of this week. Did Indiana do something to kind of take you guys high out of it? I mean, did they they put more emphasis on you guys in that game? I mean, as far as how they defended. Uh, I mean, it, you can say they did, but at the end of the day, me and Ty just um, weren't making plays like we we should have been. And, um, that's something that him and I are just like everyone else. We're going to bounce back from it and get better this week. Thanks. Thank you.